Welcome to this week's edition of My Osprey TV, Brandon's premier internet broadcasting network. Fishhawk residents plan their new budget. Got a major leaguer living in your home? Eating pancakes for a great cause. And is your understanding of the new back to school busing clear as mud? All this and a bit more right after this message from Trish Waller. Whether buying or selling your home, there is no better feeling than using a professional realtor. Let my expertise in advertising resources get your home sold in today's market. I'm Trish Waller, and I live and work in this community. If your plans involve the buying or selling of a home, it would be my pleasure to assist you. Fishhawk residents, get out your calculators. It's time for your community development district boards to approve the budgets for next year and annual payments could go up as much as $85 per household. The fund is used to pay back the bond taken out for the construction of Fishhawk Boulevard and maintenance for the common areas of the development. If you would like input on how the money is spent, attend the budget workshop on Monday, August 13th, 6 p.m. at the Palmetto Club. Do you have an aspiring baseball star at home? If so, mark your calendar for the upcoming tryouts for the Pinecrest Little League teams. On August 18th from 10 a.m. to 2 p.m., August 23rd from 6 to 8 p.m., and August 25th from 10 a.m. to 2 p.m., players aged 5 to 16 are invited to try out at the baseball Pinecrest fields off Highway 39. Start writing your list because it's almost time for back to school shopping. But while you're picking up supplies for the new school year, don't forget there are some students who are not as fortunate. The Apollo Beach Chamber of Commerce is collecting supplies from pencils, paper, and glue sticks to scissors, crayons, and more to see no student in Hillsborough County returns to school empty handed. Donations can be dropped off at the chamber throughout August. If your shopping takes you to Westfield Mall, don't forget to keep your receipts. Cash for Class, a school fundraiser where every dollar spent is counted as points, began last month at the mall and will run until September 16th. Points from purchases made at the mall are assigned to the shopper's designated school and tallied each week. The school with the most points at the end of the contest will win $10,000. What's better than a big plate of delicious pancakes? How about a big plate of pancakes and supporting a great cause? On Saturday, August 11th, the Valrico Beef O'Brady's is hosting a pancake breakfast to raise money to research a rare disease in honor of Brandon resident Stephen Angotti. The breakfast will run from 8 to 10.30 a.m. at the restaurant in the State Road 60 Sweet Bay Plaza. Confused about the changes in school bus routes for the upcoming year? Then plan to attend one of the Hillsborough County Schools public meetings scheduled this week. The meetings will take place at 5.30 p.m. on Wednesday, August 8th at East Bay High School, Thursday, August 9th at Riverview High School, Friday, August 10th at Lenart High School, and Monday, August 13th at Spoto High School. Elementary and middle school parents are invited to attend the meeting at their feeder high school. Parents will be able to receive bus routing and stop information based on the school their child is attending. That's this week's edition of My Osprey TV. I'm Angela reminding you that the best news is good news, so go out and make it a good news day. Be sure to join us next Wednesday for the latest Brandon area updates. Be sure to read your edition of the Osprey Observer for more on the stories mentioned today. See you next week.